Hi there, friends and followers. So, I'm still fiddling with this Drake TR4 transceiver, and I have low sensitivity on, on 40 meters, 20 meters, 15, 10. Anyway, you're supposed to get like an S9, according to Drake, when you turn the calibrator on, and on 80 meters, I might get an S5 or something. Anyway, the S meter is in a balanced circuit, as I've said before in these videos. And this tube here, this 12BA6, will be held off by AGC current and it will draw less current and it will cause the meter to go upward. So if this is drawing a lot of current, the meter should go... Let's see, if I pull this tube out, the meter goes up. And if I pull the 6AQ5 out, which is the audio amplifier, the meter goes down. So this doesn't seem like it'll work. Anyway, this tube is not drawing enough current. So I did investigate this R50 or 68 ohm resistor, and it's showing in about almost 300 ohms. So I think that's a problem. So I'm not getting enough draw through this thing. And that's probably the low sensitivity problem. So let's see, the 6AQ5, this thing is in a balanced circuit, and I'm trying to get back to where the meter is here. Uh, let's find the meter. There's the box, anti-box. Where is the meter? There it is, okay. So on one side of this is the 6AQ5. They're measuring the current of that. And on the other side is the, the um, 12BA6 IF amp for the receive section. So if we trace this wire back here, let's see, that one goes to the transmit. This one here, yeah. T12. Interesting. So that doesn't affect me directly, but this V11, this resistor is very high. So that would most likely limit my gain through this tube. So I'm, I'm guessing if I can repair R50 here and put it back to 68 ohms, I'm going to get more drive and this will have more drive and then the S meter will work. So that's my theory anyway. And again, we'll trace this wire down to the S meter. There it is right there. There's the S meter. And the other side of the circuit here, there's a zeroing. The other side goes to the, um, the 6AQ5, which, which I think they wanted a constant current source, just something that draws the same amount of current as a reference, which is weird, but that's what they did. So if you meander on down here, you will see the 6AQ5. There it goes. So yes, here's the 6AQ5 output transformer. And there's the uh, plate for the 6AQ5. So the audio output tube or valve gets its B plus from the S meter circuit as does the uh, as does the IF stage. So that's how they perform this balancing act. And if the IF stage is um, receiving a signal, there's less AGC, it's driven. So for high signal, it's not driven as hard. If it isn't driven as hard, then more current, less current will go through that and the meter will unbalance and it'll start going uh, upscale. So that's how it's supposed to work. And if I pull out the IF tube, which is this V12 here. If I pull V12 out, the meter will go up to about an S30 now. So I still think I have issues, but we'll see. Maybe I'll get the S meter working and some gain back, but it won't work quite right. Anyway, so that's the plan. I'm gonna change R50 here. And you might ask, well, where is R50? Huh, well, 
I will show you where R50 is. If you really want to know. R50 is buried in this mess. Okay, do you see this little resistor right there? It's got some crud on it, and it looks like it's a, um, it's a blue, looks like gray, and a black. The black means nothing, so it looks like it's going to be six, eight ohms, and it doesn't measure out to that, so I've confirmed that by measuring some of the neighbors, and there are a few more 60 ohm resistors in here for reference. I uh, got yeah, like this one here. So this is a the same resistor and I can get 68 ohms across that one. So I know this one is worn out or shot. Maybe they had a bad tube in there or something that wrecked everything. So I'm going to try and pull that one out. Wish me luck. And put a new 68 ohm resistor in there and see what happens. Okay. Thanks for watching. I know it's a great mystery, right? I just want this to be over so I can move on to other things. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.